Hi guys, uh, so we're going to continue with the complex numbers and the determinants. So please watch the previous video that I've uploaded under the complex numbers. So this is just the continuation of that. So on this question, we have something similar to, to that question that we did previously. Uh, on this one, we're still going to find the value of the determinant. So as you can see, it's a 2 by 2 matrix. Same thing is going to happen here. Note that i is equals to minus 1. i squared is equals to minus 1, imaginary. So you're going to start with these two values. So you're going to multiply that with that. Then you're going to get 3i multiplied by minus i. Then remember that when you go to the opposite direction, you minus, you minus. So when you go to that direction, you subtract. So we're going to have minus in open bracket, 1 plus i times minus 1 minus 3i. Then you have to expand this. So if you expand this, you're going to get minus 3i squared minus open bracket. Then you remove the brackets here. I'm going to say this times this, that times that. So you multiply 1 with every thing that is inside the second bracket. So you're going to get a minus 1 times a minus 3i. Then you move to this one. So we're going to say i times everything that is in the second bracket. So you're going to get minus i minus 3i squared. Okay, then the next step is to put the like terms inside the second bracket. So you're going to group the like terms. But before you group the like terms, please make sure that you, you, you expand it correctly. So you remove the bracket correctly. So please make sure. Because if you miss a sign, then it's going to be a problem. You're going to get wrong value. Okay. So here the like terms are minus 3 and i, minus i. So you're going to leave the minus 1 as it is. Then this one you're going to say minus 3 minus i, which is minus 1. You're going to get minus 4 i, minus 3. Remember? This, you can write it as i squared, or you can write it as 3 times minus 1. But let's not do that yet. So we're going to group the like terms later. You, you remove the minus now. So minus times minus 1, you're going to get a plus 1. Then minus times minus 4, you're going to get a plus 4i. Then minus times a minus 3i squared, you're going to get a plus 3i squared. Then let i squared is equals to minus 1. Then you're going to get take this and this. You see, they're going to cancel just like that. So you don't have to change anything. So your answer will be 1 plus 4i. So this is. This is your answer. This is your answer in a rectangular form. So this is a rectangular form. This is a rectangular form. So if you do have any question, please send me a DM on WhatsApp or leave my WhatsApp number. Just click on that link. And I'll also leave the link for the online session every Wednesday. Will be a Google Meet, so please do join us every Wednesday. I'll leave the link on the description below. Thank you.